Okay, um, for this problem, what I want to do is show you how to solve log of x, uh, log of x to log base x, I'm sorry, of 32 equals 5 halves. So to do this, again, what we're going to want to do is transfer this to exponential form. So remember, what I always like to remember is log base 3 of 9 equals 2. That just reminds me 3 raised to the second power equals 9. So I always write this as 3 squared equals 9. It just always reminds me of this. So when looking into this problem, we're going to do the same thing. x equals 5 halves equals 32. Now I've come up to a little problem here, right? Because how am I going to get rid of 5 halves? Well, if I had x squared equals um, you know, 16, to get rid of the square root, you would square both sides, right? So that would just be left with the square root of you know, 16. Well, so x would equal the square root of 16, as these would cancel out. Well, what exactly is you know, the square root? The square root of x is the same thing as x to the 1 half power. So what I'm going to do is, and what I'm trying to say is, if I had x squared, and what I did was I raised that to the 1 half power, that would still just leave me x. So that's something I can do here. What I'm going to want to do is, rather than you know rooting it and squared, I can just write this as x to the 5 halves. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to raise both sides to the 2 fifths. Well, what will happen here is I'm going to get x equals 5 equals 10 over 10, so it would be x to the first power, as those are going to cancel out, equals 32 to the 2 fifths. Now you might say, all right, well, you didn't really improve too much because now I still have 32 raised to the 2 over 5. So what am I going to do now with this? Well, you could just use your calculator and you know say the fifth root of 32 squared. That's perfectly fine. Um, you know, we could just write it like this. 32 equals the fifth root of 32 squared. Or What's even more powerful without a calculator is you could take a look at this and say, all right, how can I rewrite 32? Well, I can rewrite 32 as, um, or if I can rewrite it as a power, I can rewrite it as 2 to the fifth. And that's so powerful because 2 to the fifth raised to another, that means raised to another power, I can write that as x to the 2 to the fifth times 2 over 5. Put that over 1, those are going to cancel out, I'm left with x equals, sorry, 2 to the second power, which equals 4. And there you go. That's your answer. You understand that?